What's up guys, Headphones Neil here with a quick uh, review for everybody in the form of reviewing a stand-up comedy routine. So f recently I've been wanting to re-watch the old 2000 stand-up um, tour for the original Kings of Comedy with Steve Harvey, D.L. Hughley, Cedric the Entertainer, and Bernie Mac. So it just came on streaming as of the beginning of August 2021. So I gave it a rewatch and I want to say that as far as comedy goes, um, it definitely still holds up. Um, I might be biased because back when it originally came out, I did enjoy it at the time and it still holds up today. Um, the one thing that definitely stands out is that I do miss having the comedy style of Bernie Mac um, as he did pass away a few years ago. So seeing his routine now um, and especially how it directly translated into his TV show um, made for a good bit of comedy and humor. So um, if you like any one of those comedians, then I would recommend giving it a watch. The only thing that kind of does not hold up is probably the quality of the video but be, knowing that it came out in 2000 you can kind of work your way around it um, because it's a comedy tour and seeing or understanding it as a stand-up comedy tour um, makes it okay in my opinion and then like the other thing that kind of stands out is um, Steve Harvey and his hair so if you see him now like on Family Feud he's full on bald but still has the mustache so that kind of stands out. But other than that, as far as the material goes, it's still definitely funny. It uh, made me laugh and gave me a chuckle. So um, as far as a recommendation goes, I do recommend giving it a watch. Um, it is pretty raunchy. So go into that um, or go into rewatching that or especially if you haven't seen it, um, know that it is like that. So definitely don't have the kids around. Um, but at just under two hours, it is a good um, stand-up comedy tour to watch. And it kind of makes me want to watch the other spin-offs that came out of it. So the I think the original Latin Kings, Kings of Comedy, and I think there's a Queens of, the original Queens of Comedy as well, if memory serves. Um, but overall, as far as this goes, definitely a comedy tour to watch. So as far as grading it, um, I'd probably give it about an A minus um, at 90%. So like I said, the only thing that kind of doesn't stand out or hold up after all these years is the quality. Um, so that's neither uh, here nor there, but as far as the performances, the routines, the presentation, um, interstitching the comedy with the comedians talking together and just having a laugh um, together outside of the actual stand-up routine holds up. So definitely entertaining to watch still um, after 21 years. Um, so that's all there is for this particular review. So if you haven't seen it, give it a watch. If you have seen it, but it's been a while, it's now streaming on Netflix. So definitely a good stand-up routine to watch and re-watch. So that's all there is for this particular review. So if you have any questions, comments, feedback, stuff you like, didn't like about it, you can find me on Twitter at PatelN01. The website is HeadphonesNeal.Reviews for past episodes, subscription links, supporting the show, and all of that good stuff. Um, and as a heads up, I just restarted my Instagram account this past weekend. So if you wanna, if you're on Instagram and wanna give me a follow, then you can find me there at PatelN01. I'll have a link in the show notes so you can um, easily access it from there as well. And if you're a Patreon um, at patreon.com slash PatelN01, then you got a couple of um, update videos as far as the upcoming meetup in August. So um, by becoming a supporter, you get early access there as far as what's going on, the background, um, some hardware stuff and basically just like preamble prelude stuff to the actual meetup as far as preparation goes and some of the planning and that sort of stuff. So that's all there is for this particular review. Thanks for tuning in and until next time.